Well, hello there. If you're new to this channel, please don't forget to hit that like button, comment, and subscribe. So today's word is unfettered. Unfettered describes what is not controlled or restricted. It is a synonym to both of both free and unrestricted. For example, the biographer has been given unfettered access to family collection of personal correspondence. Another example is Kevin Dujardin's president of Canadian Association of Broadcasters said that before a decade were allowed unfettered access Canadian to the Canadian market, which increasingly put local TV networks at advantage. Quoted by Ethan Belsing, The Hollywood Reporter, on December 13th, 2023. Did you know a fettered is a chain or a shackle for the feet, such as the kind sometimes used for on a prisoner, or more broadly, anything that confines or restrains. Fetter and unfetter both functioning as verbs and freeing from fetters, or I'm sorry, as verbs in English with contrasting literal meanings having to do with putting on or on of and freeing from fetters. They likewise have contrasting figurative extensions having to do with <clears throat> the depriving and granting of freedom. The adjective unfettered resides mostly in the figurative with the word typically described someone or something unrestrained in process, progress, or spirit. This is how Irish author James Joyce used the word in his 1916 autobiography novel, a portrait of the artist as a young man. When the character Cranley recalls to his best friend, Stephen, what Stephen said he wishes to do in life. to discover the mode of life or of art whereby your spirit could express itself in unfettered freedom. Until next time.